Welcome to my channel. Learn English with Jasmine. Hi, friends. Today's topic is Day 4 at English Learning School. Listen carefully and then repeat after me. When I arrived, my teacher welcomed me with a big smile. I was excited to see what we would learn today. Our teacher told us that we were going to talk about our favorite things. It sounded like a lot of fun. First, our teacher shared her favorite things with us. She said her favorite color is blue, her favorite food is pizza, and her favorite animal is a dog. It was interesting to learn more about her. Then, she asked each of us to talk about our favorite things. I was a little nervous at first, but I felt better when I saw that my classmates were also excited to share. When it was my turn, I told the class that my favorite color is green, my favorite food is pasta, and my favorite animal is a cat. My classmates smiled and said they liked my choices. We took turns talking about our favorite things, and it was fun to hear what everyone liked. Some people liked ice cream, some liked chocolate, and some liked different animals like birds and rabbits. It was a great way to practice speaking English and learn more about each other. After we talked about our favorite things, we played a game. The teacher showed us pictures, and we had to say if the picture showed something we liked or not. It was a fun way to practice new words and remember what our classmates liked. At the end of the class, my teacher asked us if we enjoyed talking about our favorite things. I said yes, because it was fun to share and learn more about my friends. My classmates agreed, and we all felt happy and connected. Overall, day four at English learning class was fantastic. Now, repeat each sentence after me. When I arrived, my teacher welcomed me with a big smile. When I arrived, my teacher welcomed me with a big smile. I was excited to see what we would learn today. I was excited to see what we would learn today. Our teacher told us that we were going to talk about our favorite things. Our teacher told us that we were going to talk about our favorite things. It sounded like a lot of fun. It sounded like a lot of fun. First, our teacher shared her favorite things with us. First, our teacher shared her favorite things with us. She said her favorite color is blue. She said her favorite color is blue. Her favorite food is pizza, and her favorite animal is a dog. Her favorite food is pizza, and her favorite animal is a dog. It was interesting to learn more about her. It was interesting to learn more about her.
Then, she asked each of us to talk about our favorite things. Then, she asked each of us to talk about our favorite things. I was a little nervous at first, but I felt better when I saw that my classmates were also excited to share. I was a little nervous at first, but I felt better when I saw that my classmates were also excited to share. When it was my turn, I told the class that my favorite color is green. When it was my turn, I told the class that my favorite color is green. My favorite food is pasta, and my favorite animal is a cat. My favorite food is pasta, and my favorite animal is a cat. My classmates smiled and said they liked my choices. My classmates smiled and said they liked my choices. We took turns talking about our favorite things, and it was fun to hear what everyone liked. We took turns talking about our favorite things, and it was fun to hear what everyone liked. Some people liked ice cream, some liked chocolate. Some people liked ice cream, some liked chocolate. And some liked different animals like birds and rabbits. And some liked different animals like birds and rabbits. It was a great way to practice speaking English and learn more about each other. It was a great way to practice speaking English and learn more about each other. After we talked about our favorite things, we played a game. After we talked about our favorite things, we played a game. The teacher showed us pictures, and we had to say if the picture showed something we liked or not. The teacher showed us pictures, and we had to say if the picture showed something we liked or not. It was a fun way to practice new words and remember what our classmates liked. It was a fun way to practice new words and remember what our classmates liked. At the end of the class, my teacher asked us if we enjoyed talking about our favorite things.
At the end of the class, my teacher asked us if we enjoyed talking about our favorite things. I said yes because it was fun to share and learn more about my friends. I said yes because it was fun to share and learn more about my friends. My classmates agreed, and we all felt happy and connected. My classmates agreed, and we all felt happy and connected. Overall, day four at English learning class was fantastic. Overall, day four at English learning class was fantastic. Now, it's time to practice your English. I will give some jumbled words and you have to arrange them, in a proper way, to make sentences. First question. Her favorite shared things are teacher. Answer. Our teacher shared her favorite things. Second question. Color is said her, she, blue, favorite. Answer. She said her favorite color is blue. Third question. At I was First, a nervous little. Answer. I was a little nervous at first. Fourth question. Were also to share my classmates excited. Answer. My classmates were also excited to share. Fifth question. What it was liked to hear fun everyone. Answer. It was fun to hear what everyone liked. Now let's improve your English vocabulary. Having a good vocabulary makes you a better speaker in English. I will provide you synonyms of some words in the passage. Synonyms are words that have same meanings. Learn and memorize them. First, nervous, anxious, nervous, anxious. Second, excited, enthusiastic, excited, enthusiastic. Third, interesting, fascinating, interesting, fascinating. Well done, learners. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Comment down below. How many answers were you able to give? If you like the video then please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. Comment and tell me what topic you want to practice next. Have a good day everyone.